Hi, my name is Jessie Marie with Two Hearts Photography and Films, and today I want to talk to you about three tips to having a successful relationship with your wedding photographer. Number one, don't micromanage. Any good photographer will have gone over a shot list and timeline with you prior to the wedding day. Remember, anything that you specifically want, you should definitely talk about with your photographer before the wedding day. Coming into a wedding day, we have an idea already of what we need to do, when we need to do it, and how we want to get it done. So sit back, enjoy your family time, have fun, and trust that we're going to do exactly what you hired us to do. Number two, communicate your likes and dislikes. Remember, communication is a very pivotal part of any relationship. The same goes for the relationship with your photographer. It's really, really great to tell your photographer what you like so that they can produce things that you like. They know if you like this style or you like this setup or you like this lighting that they should do more of that on a wedding day so that you have a bunch of photos that you know you like. It's also really important to talk about what you don't like. If you know in photos that you don't like to be photographed on a certain side, then you definitely want to tell your photographer that prior to the day. Wedding days are hectic, there's a lot going on, and we only have so much time to achieve certain things. So if there's something that you don't like, you should definitely let them know so that we don't waste any of our precious time on the wedding day doing something if you already know that you're not going to like it. Number three, allow time for creativity. Photography is an art. Remember, this is something that we are incredibly passionate about as photographers. If you want those really striking, breathtaking, creative photos on your wedding day, you have to allow time for creativity. So remember, there's three tips to having a successful relationship with your wedding day photographer. Number one, don't micromanage. Number two, communicate your feelings, your likes and your dislikes. And number three, allow time for creativity. I promise you won't regret it.